I asked eight sellers and sales leaders, what's the most creative sales video you've ever sent or seen? And this is what they said. Scrolling down LinkedIn and I see, you know, if you want to get in touch with Mark, you got to play some Flav of Flav and he comes running. Don't, don't, don't Done. I'm going on Cameo. How much is Flav of Flav? Like 6K. And I'm like, okay, no. <laughs> right next to him though, was the William Hung guy. She banged, she banged. He was only $25. <laughs> like 25 bucks cash. I sent that right there. He got it back to me within like maybe 30 minutes. Hey Mark, this is William Hung. Flava Flav wants you to meet with Sharia, Amelia, and the Seamless family. So let them know when would be a good time for you. I know you can do it. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. And then I'm like, do I do this? Do I send this? Oh, we sent it. And we got a response back within like three minutes. And I was like, this is amazing. And he's like, what he said back, he was like, my kids and I are like crying laughing right now. This was amazing. I'm not your, I'm not the guy with the pen in hand. This is the guy. Here's the cell. And I'm like, boom. I made a video of me dressed in a Jedi robe at my office with like a light set the whole nine yards and I was giving a tour basically of like Jedi Dale the copier warrior and how I can help you to submit your copy machines to your very will. Two of the individuals inside of the four that made the decision and they were giant Star Wars nerds. I was like watch as I use the force on this copy machine and like holding my hand out and 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 like a piece of paper starts printing and the music starts getting louder than it jams. But it won me a $490,000 uh, initial sale, which turned into uh, 850000 in total over the course of the, the life of the contract. A wrap that I sent to Riot Games back when I was at Domino Data Lab. He did a presentation that was called 99 Problems, but Spark and Databricks ain't one. And so I created a short wrap to 99 problems, but about Domino. When I got to see migration on the Cloud Patrol data science team, yeah, we on a roll. At the end of it, he said, hey, if nothing, you deserve 30 minutes of my time. Grabbing attention of someone like that is pretty amazing. I have to go with the video that I sent to Kevin Dorsey. Does it really have a 60% chance of closing? Not so much. We surface deals at risk before they even become a problem. That video pretty much changed my entire career. Um, and I think it really solidified like who I am and it really solidified my place in tech just because for a long time, I always questioned whether I belonged here. And ever since that video went out, like I feel like I actually belong and I love where I am. So there was a partnership that we set up in the beginning of the year. They knew that we were probably all scrambling from different calls. We probably hadn't come together previously to do any of the preparation for the call. And so the way that they use video was to say, in five minutes, we're going to get everybody on the same page with what has been covered thus far, in case you haven't had an opportunity to regroup. And we're going to lay out the plan for the call tomorrow. So I think it was very clear on what's everyone's role in the call and why do you need to be there? So by watching it, and not showing up, you're kind of a punk. It was a marketing agency who was taking a look at our website and they went through and they made a short video of basically ways that we were losing leads and they were like, look, you're not, uh, not optimized for lead capture here, here, and here. Here's a quick sketch and then they shifted over to um, basically a view of Figma where they had redone a piece of the site. They're like, this is what it could look like this is just scratching the surface. We have more thoughts and ideas for you. Are you open to hearing them? It was like visual proof. You spent the time to think about a way to move our business forward instead of parroting the same feature, benefit, outcome, customer story. So my colleague actually came up with, a, with having a lighter in the end and having it as a slogan. So in, in back in the day, it was it like, if you would like to enlight the fire in your salespeople and then you actually lit the lighter, um, and then blow customers away, then you actually blew out the, the lighter. Let's have a chat. And I, I did this in my, in my cold prospecting approaches. And I had one video that got opened 230 times because when you know in Vidyard, you see how many clicks it got. So a couple of weeks later, the head of sales development came to me and was like, Jan, can you do a workshop for us? on that video. <laughs> and in the end, they were really surprised that I was actually just a, just a rep 
you know, trying to land a meeting with, with their boss instead of uh, working for, for Vidya. <laughs> so that was pretty fun, yeah. One prospect would have spoke a lot about going to the gym. So this lad that I used to work with, he made a video and he said, let me try and do this pitch whilst I'm doing sets. So he basically was like doing bicep curls um, to the point of failure, but trying to get his pitch. And you, as the video went on, he got more and more tired. And I, and I thought that was really funny. He sort of put himself out there. He tried to do something a little different. And you actually wanted to see if he did it. So you, you did want to watch it all. Be human with people, be fluent with people, and be extremely authentic and genuine in the way that you're delivering video, and you'll have incredible results from it.